What's up, YouTube? Khalil here, and today we got some bomb lasagna. And no, uh, I know y'all gonna be like, Khalil, where's the water? Today I decided to go for some juice, alright? I know I'm usually the water guy, but today I had to, uh, you know, cheat a little bit. But yeah, we got some bomb lasagna, man. I didn't place this well on this sheet. It, I suck. I really suck. But yeah, also, guys, I am doing a new giveaway. All you gotta do is wait towards the end of the video or Check the timestamp in my description below to figure out how to enter my new giveaway. Shout out to the winners of uh, last week's giveaway. And um, yeah, let's go. The reason I be using plastic forks and stuff is because, uh, your boy. You hear that sound, y'all? Do y'all hear that? Your boy does not like the clinkity clack of the plate sometimes. Them juicy lasagna noodles right there. Ooh. Oh, yeah, baby. Mmm. 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 So good. I love like a lasagna, baked ziti. I haven't had pasta in so long. <laughs> Cause I've been dieting and stuff. Mmm. Mm -mm -mm. So good, dude. Oh, shoot. This lasagna is so breakable. <clears throat> yeah, baby. Ooh, tell me that don't look good on camera. Oh, I'm dropping it. No. I gotta eat it. Mmm. <laughs> Again, man, shout out to everybody who smashes the like button. As soon as they watch the video or click on the video, man, I appreciate y'all so much. And if you haven't smashed the like button, please smash the like button. It would mean a lot. It helps the video grow, man. Y'all been killing it with the with the likes, dog. I can't even lie. I was not getting likes like this, man. <laughs> so shout out to y'all. Because y'all definitely came through. Mmm. I'm making a mess. Somebody was complaining on Twitter, cause on Facebook, cause their food was touching, and I was like, I posted it on the, on 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 YouTube too. I'm sure some of y'all saw it on my in the community. I was like, you can't eat your food if they touch. I've been, I'm no offense to who can, but bro. I must have exotic taste buds or something. Because a lot of people were like, mm -mm, I'm going to throw up. I can't. If my food touched my... And it was like mac and cheese touching like baked beans. So I was like, yo, what are you going to do when that last little bit is on the plate, right? When, when there's like a little bit on the plate, I scoop all of it up and just eat it. Just get that last little spoonful. Like, I'm surprised that a lot of people really can't eat their food, like, touching. Like, somebody said they'll throw the whole plate away. In my opinion, it's going in the same place. Like, it's going down in the same place. <clears throat> It's all going to the same plate. And sometimes when you mix the flavors together, ooh, it be hitting like, ooh. That drug be hitting. People be tripping. I used to put sugar all up in my um my lasagna. I 
I put sugar in my spaghetti. <laughs> I used to put sugar in a lot of stuff. <laughs> Mm. Mm. This will be a bomb ASMR, I can't even lie. <laughs> But yeah, I used to do a lot of weird stuff. Like add like barbecue sauce to my macaroni. <laughs> I used to put barbecue sauce on everything. I used to freaking add sugar to my grits. Barbecue sauce to my eggs. Some people don't like ketchup on eggs. Like I love ketchup on eggs. I don't know how y'all don't like stuff on your eggs. My taste buds must be really like exotic, like they just like different thing, like you know what I mean. I don't know if I'm using that word wrong. Exotic taste buds, but you know, yeah, I know what I'm saying, dog. Like dumb people can't eat beans and meat and rice mixed together. And my mom make bean meat and rice, and I'm and she put the rice. The um, it's like beans mixed with um. With beef, I just put it on top of the rice, and when I get it, I just mix it all up and I just eat it. I just be chowing down. Woo! Speaking of my mom, man, she be going to school, been working at this new restaurant, because she be chefing, and she kills it, I mean, she kills it. She'll be posting on her Instagram soon, I'm going to let y'all know her Instagram in the future videos, but it would be dope if y'all could follow her and show her love and stuff like that. And check out her food, man, if y'all like seeing dope food. Speaking of college, I used to take a class, and the reason we love our moms, and this might sound cliche, but I took um, I took a class <clears throat> all about the human body, your uh, psychology. I think it's I think it was psychology, and um, they would teach you stuff about like humans and how they react and stuff. And it is said that the reason we love our mom's cooking so much is because we like stuff that is made from people we love or admire. You know what I'm saying? So. Don't know exactly what it is. I forgot the whole background of it. But when something is made from somebody we love or we admire in, in scientific terms if you don't want to count love is you know what I'm saying our brains automatically like it more it, it tastes better to us because of the fact that we have such a connection with that person that made it you know what I'm saying so if y'all ever wonder why y'all like your mom's cooking so much I'm not saying she not a good cook it's, but that is definitely a part of the reason or why you love your grandma's cooking more than anything, you know what I'm saying? Teaching, I'm teaching y'all stuff. Man, this is a classroom right now. This is a mukbang classroom, dog. We, we going to school. <laughs> I also learned some other crazy stuff in that class, like... The more time you spend with somebody, the more time they become attracted to you. That's why 
80%, I think it was 80% of, um, cheating, cheatings, when you're married and stuff like that, happen in the workplace, because you're always around that person, more than you are your significant other. I also learned, <laughs> let me stop preach. I'm preaching, let me stop, let me stop, dog. A person is more likely to like you instead of when you call it when you start saying their name more. So say if you start and what I mean like is like um like a friendly like, not like you know what I mean I'm in love with you or not. It's like say if I was like instead of saying what's up you or hey you or hey, you know what I'm saying? Somebody is going to respond more positively to their name being called. It's all it's all psychological. <laughs> but I was like, yo, Maria, you know what I mean? She'll respond more positively to, to yo, Maria than yo, you know what I'm saying? Just keep these little little tokens I'm giving y'all. Just keep, you know what I mean? It'll help you out in life. What else did I learn in that class? I learned a lot about like humans and why am I saying humans? Like I'm not a human, like I'm an alien. I learned about a lot about my own species and how their brain works and stuff like that. That's what I learned about, dude. Sheesh. Woo. I haven't eaten pasta in so long that my body is just like, yo, chillax. You full, bro. <laughs> but yeah, I'm full, man. I'm about to call it a day and say, hey, hey, hey. I didn't hate. This new giveaway I'm doing, y'all, if you guys want $25, I might bump it up to $100. But. This new giveaway, all you got to do is sign up to the app in my bio, link your bank to be verified, for the account to be verified. And then once you're done, just type done in the comment of this video. If you don't, if you don't, can't click on the link in the bio. You can easily go to my Twitter, which is also on my bio. And the giveaway is going to be pinned to the top of my tweet. And when you sign up, link your bank, you can tweet me a picture of that you signed up and all this other, and um, your, your cash up and stuff like that. So yeah, man. It's an easy giveaway. You just sign, It takes two seconds of your life. Sign up. And you can win. Two minutes of your life. One minute of your life. $25. Might switch it up to 100 who knows? But yeah, man, shout out to the winners of um, the last giveaway, man. I was giving away 50s like crazy. I accidentally sent one of y'all $100 by accident. I wasn't going to ask for a back, though. You know what I mean? <laughs> I felt bad because she, she was happy. So, um, yeah, man. I'm a bounce. I'm full, dog. Peace out. I love y'all. End of the giveaway. Smash that like button. Follow me on Instagram. Peace.